Hello Twitch and YouTube, I am here, I am about to play Minecraft Bedded Rock Edition for, uh, until, because I'm very tired, I was going to play some other stuff, but this is just easier. No, wrong one. Move the mouse please, okay. I need a scroll ball, uh, a, a trackball mouse, because this kind of mouse movement is really bad for my fucking hands. They don't want to do anything properly. Alright. In any case, let's get to the game. Oh boy. That's right, the game was set to be 4x3. Give me a second. Alright, alright. Give me a second. Properties. Do -do -do. No, no, no. Device default. There we go. Oh, perfect, and it automatically fits it to the screen. Isn't that wonderful? Let me just make sure it's fit to the screen. Uh, b -b 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 transform. Fit to screen. Perfect. All right. I'm looking to get a Sega Genesis controller to play this, because I could play it without one, but it feels like I should have one. But, you may have seen in the title, we're going to be playing in my realm. We're going to be playing... What the hell is it called? Uh, we're going to be trying to build a huge platform to get the... Like, not necessarily a platform. I want it to be an actual build, but I'm trying to get the Star Trader achievement. Which is for... Uh, trading with a uh, villager at build limit. Yes, 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 whatever. Oh, a map. Sure, you know what? Let's go ahead and get that for free right now, because it's probably, if, if it's free. If it's not free, if it's like, oh yeah, wh wh why would you get it for free? Like, oh, okay, I thought you were just like, trying to advertise me something free. It, it is free. It's trying to advertise me something else. <laughs> Puma shoes. Oh, uh, Puma shoes. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, these look awful. No offense to the person who created them. This, like, this sort of style. I hate this style. With the fucking, uh, oh, what, what it's the higher resolution style. The fact that these heads aren't like 8x8 eight eight or 8 pixels. Is it 8 or 16 pixels? Hold on, let me look at my character's face. See, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, the fact that those are 16 pixels across instead of 8 really fucks me up. Ah, uh, my character blinked. Oh, God. Oh, uh, yeah, this one, in case you're wondering, this was one of those, uh, one of those worlds that it has, it was supposed to be like a one block sky block, but it really sucks, and, uh, well, it doesn't suck, it's just, it's just okay. And, uh, it feels like, it feels like a ripoff. I'm glad I didn't pay for it, because it came with realms. Uh-oh. Okay. I may need to update. Oh, no, okay. Said my realm was going to update soon. So I also would need to update. I don't know what it means by that. Oh, these guys. I forgot about these guys. I'm in here. And a pro Oh, it was probably you, wasn't it? I kind of, I'm kind of sick of these guys. Wow. So many things just lying around. See, there are guys over here. There's not guys over here. That's weird. Normally, there's guys over there that uh, that suck. All right. 
Sure, I'll pick up the pearls. I don't need them, but hey, why not, you know? Is that evening? Is it already almost evening? I literally just joined in. Maddening. Oh, it didn't let me hurt myself? That's so dumb. There we go. Oh, this was from uh, my mining session when I went down to the thing that I knew was in fact a mine. Or a, a, an iron vein. Oh, what the hell am I doing? I really have to... Mm, what blocks do I need? Okay, there's a bunch of these. Oh, these beds are for, uh, for my eventual iron farm. I have yet to build that because it's a lot of work to do, you know? Oh, it's a music disc. Respiration. McBacklin. <coughs> okay, what's in this? Oh, that's all sold campfires. Those do slightly more damage for some reason. Oh, that's something I was going to do right now. I was going to make sure that this world is set to hard. It is. Okay, good. the heck I love look look at this you can see the low res textures like the solid textures oh you can see where it becomes them too oh my gosh there's just like a row of trees I probably also ought to rebreed up some fast horses since they uh Apparently removed the bug about uh, horses being like animal. They they removed the bug of animals disappearing at all. So that's pretty good. Lots of gravel. I'm thinking I should use quartz for my. Uh, for my big build that I'm gonna build. Oh, we got all these. Fire charge field mason thing. The thing one was important. Iron boots with protection four. Why would I have these at all? Don't know. Irrelevant to me right now. Oh, wow. Look at all this junk. What am I going to do with all this junk? Get it? Get it, guys? I'm funny. I'm clever. I'm a genius. <coughs> Alright. Basically, I'll tell you this. One of the things I'm going to do is basically I'm going to be building... A, uh, a, a a village at at uh, build limit or at build height essentially you know I kind of like the concept of doing a bunch of different colored beds that's a cool idea to me like I want to build a whole ass village and have like one guy that I've decided is the captain I want his just his bed or his uh trade station to be at the highest point it can be for some reason or his his workstation to be at the top achievement station do i have that i think i have that on here probably but hey just in case you never can tell and i think i'm going to be using these for lighting in that area because i'm like what am i going to use sea lanterns for they just look fancy and it's like I don't I don't make builds that look fancy and like modern I make I make caves like look at look at this cave I built admittedly most of this was just modifying a different cave but I modified that cave this one over here to have this entrance which is pretty cool and it goes into here and you cannot see through this but I can it's really cool And I think I might still be making this like the outside shell of what I'm building out of regular stone. So I may need to use that. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now you know what? 
forget it. All right, now what I do is, that's right. We're gonna put some more sticks in my uh, furnace set up over here. Putting my where the hell was I putting my tough blocks? Yo, we got two whole amethyst clusters. Oh my god, I just realized the thing I'm building is definitely somewhere like since I need to build this now for a different achievement, this is where I could put my uh, iron golems for the iron golem achievement. Genius. I'm glad I just thought of that right now. Like, ah, of course. Of course. Oh, great. I got monster junk in my inventory. Like, what the hell have I been doing with spider eyes? Why do I have a fireworks star? Oh, I just remembered something that I've seen recently. And I need to see if it works with different stuff thing I need to go to the end and I need to see if this can knock off the chorus flowers because I saw a guy recently in Java edition admittedly so I don't know if this will work for me but I saw him uh, he was popping them off with uh with a bow, and I'm like, oh my god, can you do that with, uh, with other stuff? Oh, this reminds me right here. See this? I'm trying to get a, I've tried to get a skeleton to spawn in there. I need someone else over there. I need someone close enough for mobs to spawn over there. But not so far away that, like, because you need to kill an, a skeleton from 50 meters away with an arrow. Because if I leave someone, like, right here, it won't spawn. It'll, because they don't like to spawn right underneath you. They want to spawn a certain distance away. But 50 blocks, everything despawns it in, in a realm. So I think at this distance, it might spawn, but I would need someone else to log in and make sure it stays spawned. And to break away the front block so you could shoot it through the front block. I'm sitting here and I'm getting like hunger from running and it's like is it because I'm jumping because I know that there was a bug in this where regular sprinting doesn't remove doesn't lower your uh, food meter I wonder if they fixed that in a recent update perhaps perhaps I was, like, I didn't think it was, oh, I just remembered something that I saw. You, you can silk touch, apparently, in at least in Java, you, you can, with a silk touch item that is not a pickaxe, you can get silverfish blocks. You can collect silverfish blocks as long as you silk touch them with something that is not a pickaxe. And uh, then the fun part is like, you just, what you should do then is you get a bunch of them and then you go to a, uh, to your friend's house and then you leave in one regular silverfish, name him, and then run away and hide him. So that way your friend is like, ugh, what's going on here? And they go after and they look for him and boom, suddenly there's a little freak out there. 
It's like, oh god. And they die. Wouldn't that be funny? Pranking your friend like that? <sighs> We're going to the Enderman farm. It's not a great one, but it works. We're going there for XP though. To repair my armor. He didn't build this tall enough for them to take fall damage, or for them to not take fall damage. Or for them to take enough fall damage where it's one hit to kill them. And we can pin that blame on Griffin, because he is a fool. So how's my, my, my wings, my Elytra? Not full yet, and I would like to have it full before I go flying out into the end. Flying out into the void, you know? Because my goal is to go fly out into the void. My wings are filled up now. Alright. We're going to get another stack. No, 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 that's right, that's right. We want to put this back. So we gotta make sure that our portal is at like zero zero. Cause I'm pretty sure it is. Okay, so our portal is about at zero zero. Okay, so hold on, so this is zero on the Z. And this is zero on the X. Okay, yeah, so the portal's at zero zero. I should probably get more wither wither skulls at some point. Also, just fly off in a random direction. It's scary when you're falling like this, but it works. Okay. Haha. -ha. I knew it worked. Because here I am. Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. You ever just accidentally look at an Enderman? It sucks. Holy crap. How did I piss off all of them at once? Okay. That sucked. Excuse me. Gold box? No. Gold box. Put down. Pull out another one of these. I have done a lot of raids, by the way, in case you're wondering, like, how do you have so many of those? I do not have a raid farm yet. Okay, okay, so that doesn't work. At least not in this one. So let's get out my tools box. That's fine. That's fine. We're gonna try something else. Come on, Wednesday. Okay, so it works with crossbows though. Good to know. 
You know, while I'm here, let's see if I can find another uh, uh, end city. And I'm gonna freaking, if I do find one, I'm gonna just sort of leave it alone and wait till they add the freaking shulker box duplicating mechanic so I can build a shulker farm because one of those would be really cool. Okay, so if I go here, there's an end gateway. Wow. The void. Scary. Scared of the void. In Minecraft. Void IRL, eh, you know. Sometimes you just fall forever. Starving to death would be the worst part. Unless, of course, it's the kind of magical void where you don't starve to death. And you don't need to drink and you just sort of fall forever. That would suck. Okay. Nothing. I've been f flying all over these damn wastes and I've found nothing. Well, the render distance is really low right now in uh, all this stuff. But hey, you know, sometimes it's like that. Oh, here's a villa, or here's an end city. Looks like someone's been to this one, though. Nope. Okay. Did I have no blocks? Wow. I am a freaking moron. I want shulker boxes because I think they're important, you know? I want I want to have organ I want to build a proper sorting area. So that way it's like all the stuff that I have like hundreds of, I can just like that I have more than a double chest of, or almost more than a double chest of. Or stuff that I'm going to have more than a double chest of. You know, I was watching someone do an end city and s someone mentioned uh, the banners and I was like I forgot about the banners are you kidding me they teleported outside the bastard shovel with unbreaking and mending. That's pretty cool. What was I going to I was about to eat a food in Minecraft. It's fine. It's whatever. I'll do this the stupid way. And it's only the stupid way because I'm doing it. If someone else did it, it would be fine and normal. Nice, we got some gold. Another iron helmet. Oh, oh great, and I stopped freaking mining. Not a lot of good stuff in this end city, but hey, you know, sometimes you find an empty end city. Oh no. Okay, it's fine.
kind of messed up how you could genocide shulkers so that shulkers just don't exist in your world anymore. Hmm. How should I get this guy? Yep, so I get. Let's just fly up and smack him. Still only seven shulker box shells, huh? Aha, there was some more. Excuse me. Fine men. Fine, uh... Endermen that don't scare me at all. This is a double joke because I'm actually not scared of Endermen. Though they did almost get me. Oh, what the hell? Those guys are outside of this one? Fucking kidding me. How many of these guys are pissed off? Oh god. Oh my god, I got him with the thorns. I got him with the thorns. That was crazy. And, like, I knew it was possible. I wasn't expecting it. Let's just keep flying until we find uh, either until we find an end gate. We'll just say until we find an end gate. We're looking for a way back. Last time I was here in the end, I was here for helping Griffin. Jeesh. You ever help Griffin? Probably not. He wanted to get his own Elytra. 
partly for flying into his big old pit. Have I fallen into that big old pit in this? Yes, I did. I did. I did fall into that big old pit in uh, on the switch. Oh, my Elytra is fine. I was really worried for a moment, like, oh man, are my Elytra going to break anytime soon? No, no, they're fine. You know, I might want to start farming purper, like, or farming these for, uh, to make purper blocks. Because I feel like that'd be a good look for the build I'm going to be making. Because as I said, it's going to look sort of modern, sort of futuristic. Oh, end, er, end gateway. What the hell is this over here? What are these weird little chunks? Oh, a shitty, an end shitty. I wasn't gonna, but hey, you know, sometimes you just find an end shitty and you gotta. Oh, yo, this is such a, this is actually an end awesome. The freaking stuff grew through it. That's so cool. You ever been in an end city like that? It's so cool. I, like, I'm legitimately excited by it. What the heck? More foam? All right, awesome, perfect. This is, that sounds sarcastic. It was not, that was legitimately what I wanted was to get hit. So I didn't have to do their weird parkour. All right, we got protection three pants. Ooh, unbreaking mending and efficiency pickaxe. That's really cool. Gold, gold, emeralds. I don't really need emeralds, but I also don't need spider eyes. Uh, or zombie meat. Diamond shovel. Iron helmet. Sure, I'll pick those up. What do they have on them? Efficiency 3. Unbreaking protection and mending. Uh, these are pretty good. This is some pretty good equipment I got in here. I don't fucking want the zombie meat. It can go to hell for all I care. Oh, that's right. Here's an important question is, did you know you could do the thing I've been doing where I uh, dive? It only works if you have uh, Elytra, but if you have an Elytra and you've been put under the effects of levitation, you can dive by activating your Elytra. I got 21 Shulker Shells. That's pretty good. Excuse me. Okay, now I need to find where that end gateway was. Oh, that's right. It was over here. Because I flew towards these. And then that end shitty uh, just sort of showed up. Just got to fly away far enough for that guy to despawn. And he's despawned now, probably. So, hey, yeah, let's try to... Oh, come on. I can freaking do this. I'm 
excuse me? Why did I just suddenly stop? Oh cool, it spawned me at the start. I thought it would put me somewhere else nearby, but nope, put me right at the start. Awesome. Oh, while I'm here, I ought to also go get some more uh, XP, repair my uh, stuff, just because I can, because I'm here, you know? I mean, why not? When in the end, do as the Enders do. Oh, sorry, I was doing as the Enders do. I was getting really mad because, uh, because you looked at my face. Hell yeah. This isn't the most efficient. I mean, I've seen that most of the time when people do this, they go all the way to, like, zero, and he only went to 21 for this, but it's still pretty good. It's the best XP farm we have. I don't even need to do this. I'm just doing this for the hell of it, I guess. Look at that. That is a lot of ender pearls. What do we even need that many ender pearls for? It would make sense if nobody on the server and nobody on my uh nobody in my rem had Elytra, but literally everyone who has played for any like reasonable portion of time on my server. You know, yeah, we'll just keep going with the server. Uh reads re technically everyone has a has an Elytra. Griffin went through the trouble of getting one. Merlin was in here, f like, I spent, like, a few hours in the end looking for an Elytra. Griffin spent about 30 minutes, which is fair, I think. Uh, and then me, I spent a few hours and Merlin spent, like, 10 minutes. It's bullcrap. Can you believe that? The absolute nonsense of it. Ooh, turn away for a few seconds and there's a whole army of Endermen. You splash water bottles. <laughs> that is a thing you can do, by the way. Splash water bottles on these freakos. <clears throat> and they can't teleport because everything's covered in carpet. And they can walk on carpet and they can be on carpet, but they can't teleport onto carpet. I don't know why. You have to ask uh, Jeb or something. You know, you know that Jeb Bush's name is uh, redund has redundancies because the 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 Jeb part of his name is for like James or John Edward Bush. So calling him Jeb Bush, it's like saying it's like saying ATM machine. It's weird. It's unnecessary. We don't even need all these levels, but I'm getting them anyway. <laughs> I'll tell you though, if, job, if Bedrock Edition had a way to uh, duplicate do TNT duping, I would absolutely be waiting for a, the skulk to come out and be building a uh, a skulk farm. Oh, that's so sus. That's so sus. This is so sus, guys. Uh. 
I'm not going to keep doing that because it's stressing me out and I'm the person who's doing it. We teleport. Oh, cool. Back home. Hello. What do we got? Okay, that's right. We got a bunch of... Why do I keep looting all the freaking end cities? I don't need all the crap in them. Why was it? Why did it even go to the end? Oh, that's right. It was to see if you could use a trident to mine uh, whatevers. And you cannot. Oh my god. We have seven bones? Why do I. Like, I understand I have bones, whatever. Why do I have seven? That's weird. Another great thing is if I want to put a bunch of quartz in my build, which I do want to do, I don't have to use like this quartz that I got from like the nether. Because I have like a, an ass load of mason villagers. So it's like, who needs, I, I can buy everything I need. <laughs> oh, that's right. I have these. It's really funny. The reason I have these is because I've I've been going to every time I build one of the the withers, I go and I take I am stalling because I don't want to do it. I'll be honest with you. That is the reason why I have not left yet. Take those bones out of there. Don't need those in there. Cocoa beans mushrooms I can move all this other stuff elsewhere this is now my chest for end city loot <coughs> and only for end city loot <coughs> which means I'm gonna have to find a new place for all this other stuff oh no where will I find a place to put all it <coughs> I know I got a bunch of obsidian somewhere else in here, perhaps. If not, I do now. Alright. Oh, I also need to find out what to do with this. Uh, this extra gold helmet. And that's right, I wanted to have a suit of like, like a suit of every type of armor. Wow, that's a lot of wool that I have here. I wanted to have suits of like every type of armor, just like on display. I have a leather and a chain, I believe. I can go check. So I got leather and I got chain. All right, all right. We're clearing out our inventory pretty good. Um, we gotta, you know what, I'll just put the gold helmet in here. Sure, why not? It's got Curse of Vanishing on it. What the heck? Oh, man. See, right now I got this whole chest here full of crap that I don't know what to do with. And that's a problem. Okay, brain, come on, kick on. Sure, whatever, we'll just 
drop some crap around because once again I have a bunch of crap I don't know what to do with all right you know what I'm gonna go ahead and do I have any empty boxes this one's filled with cobblestone that's not what I'm looking for You know what? I'm also going to want uh, a ass load of, uh, okay, cool. I need a, I forgot I needed a, a shulker. Also, let me, while I'm here, I'm going to check because I forget what, ach what achievements I don't have on this version. Load my achievements. Star Trader, that's the one I'm going for right now. Sail the seven seas, visit all seven ocean bi all, visit all ocean biomes. That's kind of messed up that I haven't been getting that. This one is also bullcrap. This one is not going to be easy, but it's not going to be bullcrap. But yeah, I'm going to create a big. Uh, a big thing and then you'll you'll all be like oh that's what you built crazy and you'll you'll be just as unenthused as that God. Can't make a shul yeah, I was gonna say you can't make it you have to use a crafting table to make a shulker box. Alright, so we're gonna fill a couple of my shulkers with as much stone as possible. Because stone's not like. Oh, we're full again. All right. going to take any non-full stacks. <sighs> now to fill up the rest of my boxes, I have to go through here. See you on the other side, folks. Ah, we're on the other side. Wonderful. All right. I need to alter the way this is so that way I can like actually go to the places I want to go at a reasonable pace. Oh, you know what? I'm going to need to go over here also later anyway. That's fine, though. Because right around the corner here, we have this. And this machine, dear friends, is a villager breeder. We got these two idiots up here and they are making me some plains villagers I love them or sorry they are making me savannah villagers that I think are really cool you look at all these baby villagers in here because they get big and then they 
their heads hit the water stream and they float up and they f when they float up they get flowed into this pit here but I need to fly this away ah, my legs they're kicking we I think yes this is the this is what I'm doing and so I'm going to be taking some villages from there and uh, putting them in my uh, new thing that I'm going to build. It's going to be cool. We're all going to love it. It's going to be cool. God, I should probably get around to doing my Animal Crossing stuff. Because I don't like it whenever I, I don't have all my daily Animal Crossing stuff done. It sucks, like, on an emotional level kills me and makes me want to kill Let's see. I am flying the right way right I remember this swamp it's just been a while since I've been over here oh, God damn it. somewhere around here is a mountain I found it. No, over here I found it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somewhere around here. Oh, here it is. Perfect. I still have a beacon over here. That's crazy. But you may be wondering, self, so what, what's this fool doing over here, huh? This is what I'm doing over here. In case you were really wondering what I was, what I was doing over here, is I, I, I come over here whenever I, like I came over here. Initially, it was whenever they thought that there wasn't going to be any more, or when they thought that they weren't going to do, uh, what was it called? When they thought that Deep Slate Emerald Ores were not going to be a thing, so I wanted to get as many as possible. And so I came out here to get Deep Slate Emerald Ore. You may also be wondering, like, okay, then well, what, what, why you come over here now? Because I saved everything. All these chests filled with the spoils of war. And then for funsies, for funsies, something fun and interesting. So when I started to expand. Did I not put any over here? I thought I put some over here. It's fine. I still have a shitload. And this was the one filled with uh, ores and shit. Yeah, this one was filled with all the like ores that I got. Why do I have two? Oh, that's why I have two under chests in my inventory. <laughs> I'm thinking this one's not quite full. Perfect. Stone, 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 stone. For some reason it looked like one of them said it was 61 and I'm like, that's not right. So you can hold 9, 10, 11, 12 more. So it's got to get 12 more stacks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 
8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Perfect. Awesome. That's three shulker boxes full of smooth stone. Excuse me. I do not need you coming up and slapping my ass. You pervert. You slimy perv. Disgusting. But this also is where I got most of my slime. Down here. Wow. Because my freaking sword is looting three. And I was just down here doing stuff. And, well, when you're doing stuff around slimes, you get a lot of slime balls. No. 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 That was my impression of the man from the War of Stars. Oh yeah, this was like pre uh, 1.18 stuff. This was just like 1.17. When they did the, like, oh yeah, we'll add some of the stuff from Caves and Cliffs, but we won't actually add the Caves or the Cliffs yet. Yeah, I wonder if I dug down at this point. I wonder how, how uh, good that would work. Especially since if I go to some of these like pits where I have st had stuff, I'm pretty sure a lot of these pits had bedrock at the bottom. Not these small pits, but like these ones that are like three blocks deep. Not that one either. Come on. I know some of these were deep enough. Oh well. In any case, some of them had bedrock at the bottom. I'm certain of this. Fairly certain. Is this like a joke to me? Whatever. I can try to fly out the hole for the other one. Uh... Awesome. That's cool. That feels really cool. Where the heck is the other beacon beam? Should be around here somewhere. Oh, oh. Getting close to it. I can't see it though. No idea. It has to be somewhere. I, I, I want to find where that is before I uh, stop. Or before I go back. The reason I did it in a mount, did the whole thing in the mountain biome also, as I, you know, I already indicated that it was for emerald ore. I just love the look of emerald ore. <sighs> emerald ore, what? Uh -huh. <coughs>
perhaps the beacon's beam is not rendering for some reason. I'll just have to assume that that's the case. Because if I don't, I'll go mad looking, lo looking for it. also possible that if it's not rendering it's because it was built in 1.17 like an update ago oh my god my ass hurt oh 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 it's one of my favorite things to do i love flying through this trench feels like i'm the star wars man now A big desert. I love me a big dessert. Ah. Oh, one of these things could be great if I ever need to uh, build a raid farm. Which is something I would love to do. It'd be pretty cool. Fuck. I have no idea... I know I'm at the right approximate area. I, oh, there's my glacier. That means I'm... That means I know I'm at the right area because I literally came to this place initially for ice. As you can tell by these two... Or as you might be able to tell by these two toppled piles. I came here for ice. Why did I fill that up with netherrack? Don't know. All right, I have to think of a place to build this. You know, desert over here might not be a bad idea for it. Especially since, like, I like the idea of them, like... Oh. I don't think uh, this is normal. I think there's a bit too many uh, flowers here. I think this is a meadow biome. I think this would be. Yeah, this is... This is some cool generation. Honestly, I love it. It's It sounds weird to say, I love this. This looks so wrong. Hey, maybe also I can move some villagers from over here to be at my uh, upcoming base because I want I like the idea of building it in this desert over here move some villagers from that mountain and then we'll have three types of villagers in one village and as I said I plan on building a whole thing it's gonna be real big in fact I might even like get some villagers over here so that way I can have four types of villagers because I like the idea of having plains villagers and desert villagers <laughs> and ice villagers and uh, savanna vill villagers at the same, all in the same area. Good God, this meadow biome sucks. Oh, wow. This is a nice mountain. This is a nice mountain. And that, <coughs> that desert is really small. Oh, this is also a pretty cool mountain. Oh, meadow biome. This is what the Caves and Cliffs update was about, folks. This. This is an incredible trench. Holy crap. This may not even be Caves and Cliffs generation, but it just feels like it is. Because for some reason, all the freaking, uh... Like, all the hilltops are covered in flowers... Ooh, ooh, this is definitely Caves and Cliffs generation. Oh, and so is this. Ah, I was going to fly in it, but then I got scared. I don't need to get scared. I have a, I have a one-up.
cool. I think I might just want to go somewhere else. It's farther away from these guys. Though it would be kind of cool to have like a village like that I built not too far from the thing. Like not too far from where I'm where I have my villager breeder. What was I getting from here? This. I think also I think it's whack that they didn't keep the changes to Elytra. They should have kept the changes from that one beta for Elytra. This would be great if I could remember where the hell I came from. Okay. Oh good, here's my old village. That means I need to just go this way, I think. Yep, here's my villager breeder. Well, he went into there because he got mad. He didn't like it. Really should have scouted this sort of thing out beforehand. I really should have. I'll, I'll admit it. But also if I bring in some guys from this other nearby village that I see, or that I had seen, uh, I wouldn't even have to bring in new desert villagers. Oh, now this is a mountain, friend. Oh, boy. Okay, I have to fly through this tunnel. Through this, uh, this tunnel that looks like this. Oh yeah, that felt awesome. Oh, lots of azure bluets and cornflowers at the bottom of this. So note, if you ever need blue dye, uh, you can go to a mountain. Go to a mountain, build a flower farm. Or you could be cool and just play in Bedrock Edition where... Uh, let me show you something super sick about Bedrock Edition. Boom. Grows more of that flower. Boom. Grows more of that flower. Uh, and we'll hit, the, we'll hit the corn flower too. Grows more of that flower. That's cool. Gray sheep. I need to get a goat and bring it to my house area and then name it so that way it stays. Since that works now, apparently. Keep him in a boat and name him so that he doesn't leave and so that every time I play I can sort of trick myself into thinking ha 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 I'm getting an achievement that I've already gotten because I've already gotten the achievement you see so, and I'm also thinking to myself it'd be a good idea to get these guys because then I can abduct them and it'll work with my theme that I'm going for or I'm abducting them on purpose
That is, in case you haven't figured out the theme, I'm not telling anyone yet. Those beetroots filled it up fast, and I don't know if it was luck or what. Put these flowers in too, because I don't need them. And I know making the thing I'm making out of stone is going to be weird, but it's... It's the closest thing I have to what I actually want. Which would be literally anything. I think I do like putting it in the middle of this desert. I have a village that I can trade with. Let's see, actually, let's make sure. So 241968, or 241968. Oh, that's the wrong way. No, that's actually a good idea. Okay, in the village center for this one, which I might end up destroying this one because it might be too close. The village center is more than 100 blocks away. That's fine. And you know what? I'm going to be putting them up in a huge thing in the sky, so I guess it doesn't really matter that much. Oh, desert well. There was a bug at one point. Okay, so now we got to make sure that these guys don't try to link to beds over here and these guys over here don't try to link to beds over there. Yo, they're making more? What the hell? They're making more. These horn dogs. You believe these freaks? Okay, and this is at 2565 and 164. I think since these are the first beds, it's like, okay. Yeah, this over there should be pretty good. Perhaps a little, a little more. The, See, that's the problem. I really want to build it in the middle of the desert. Oh, I could build it over this. <gasps> build it over the ice glacier. Oh my gosh, that's a genius idea that I just had. I'm going to build it over the glacier. So that way it's far enough away from the other villages. But I can steal a few villages from each of those. And we'll have desert villagers. And oh yes, this is... This is good. I'm glad I thought of this. It's definitely far enough away from the other villages. And I can get... And I can kidnap some villagers from each of the other ones. Or abduct them, rather. I can abduct some villagers from each of the other ones. And the only problem I'm seeing is I see this guy over here. And I'm like, hmm... kind of dangerous especially since if, even if I put especially if I put it way up in the sky there's gonna be uh, ice I'm gonna have to deal with ice I'm not a fan of having to deal with that <sighs> like with with water blocks freezing over Maybe I can find something nearby that's similar. Where I might get a, a villager like that. Ocean biome. Maybe I should get a villager from an ocean biome. <laughs> ocean biome. Oh! Fun. A little streak of... Oh, no, no, no. These are rocky shores. I thought that this was a... Uh, Mycelium? No, this is rocky shores. Not mycelium y shores. I still want to, I like, I like the idea of maybe putting it over the ocean nearby here. Not a bad idea, I think. Oh, there's some swamp here. Oh, that's... 
yo, this is the most messed up looking, like, mushroom that I've ever seen. This is naturally generated. I didn't mean to take a video of that. I meant to take a screen cap, but you know what? We'll deal with it. Oh? What the hell is this? Oh, we can also get some steal some villages from here. These guys are villages without a village. You ever seen that? Bunch of villages with no village? Is their village sunken? Oh yo, we got glow squid. Gotta find an aquifer. Oh, I can't swim up too fast. I'm gonna get the bends. I'm gonna be like, huh? Whoa. Get dizzy and lightheaded and shit. Oh, I fucking love this uh, weird tundra right next to a tropical... Right, there's a bunch of tropical fish over there. Okay, yeah, these guys are just villagers without a village. I'm gonna take a screen cap of these, lo of these cohorts so I can uh, make them a village like a mini village it's gonna be a shitty village but like this is all their village has is this and them and that's that's not good so we're just gonna build them like a real shitty house real quick and then we'll then you know what we'll just go ahead and steal these guys when the time comes as well as any other villages I might want That'll give us four villager types, and I think that's pretty cool. Let's get a uh, thread. I need wood for these guys to make them beds. It looks like it's... No, okay, it's midday. The lighting in Minecraft can be really confusing sometimes. We also need the wood to build them a house. This is so fucked up. Have you ever seen this happen? Like bits and pieces of a village, but no actual village. Don't go. Oh, you're already my friend. Cool. Sit. I'll get you later. Awesome. What's, what's that over there? What the heck is that on top of that tree? Oh, this is just some more buggy uh, stuff. Okay. It's quite possible that what happened was that this area was partially preloaded at one point, and then it's like, okay, well, we're doing biome blending, and uh, it's it's not a perfect thing, so uh, we'll just let it be good enough. That's fine. Kill this piggy for uh, some piggy meats. Because I hunger. I'm gonna fly away and keep coming back until I can get some damn sheep. Because that's what I really need right here in this village. Or for this village, in quotes, to work, I need sheep.
Kentucky. I mean, I could probably just leave here and these guys will stay, but like, I don't trust Minecraft enough. Okay, so let's fly away for a little bit and come back and maybe some sheep will have spawned. Yo, what the heck? Oh, jungle biome? Oh my gosh, I could have some villagers mate here and get a jungle villager baby. I love jungle villagers. They look really cool. Of course, the trick is I want to wait until that jungle, like any villager that I plant, I want to make sure that they end up as an adult properly, so that way I make sure that they're not a nitwit. God dang. I'm getting notifications out the asshole, figuratively, mind you. Alright, now I know they're going to be peeved that I just made a bed for myself and then broke it, but I am someone who does not care about that. I care about things, but not these things. Okay, what I need to do is I need to find, oh, there's a little bat down, a sheep, perfect, I can make, I can start making them a, some beds. Do I have shears in my toolbox? I do, don't I, because I'm smart. I do, I got vending machine. I don't know why I named it vending machine, but boy howdy I did. <gasps> Two sheep. Beautiful. Oh, this is perfect. That's enough for two beds. That's great. And then those sheep are going to eat some stuff. <gasps> Another guy. Come on, drop three, drop three. He didn't drop three. He only dropped two. But that's fine. That's fine. This is great. I'm excited. We have sheep here. We can start making these villagers some beds. Okay, we'll start here. Two, three, four. Go four blocks back. One, two, three, four. Then we'll go, uh, let's go to about here. One, two, three, four. Did I go right? Yes, I did. Good. Then here. Yeah, here. Then we'll go one, two, three. We're going to be digging out the rest of that stuff. It's fine. I just need to get my, uh, Oh god damn it. I made my orange bed white. It's supposed to be it's it needs to be orange cuz that's my bed that's my orange bed. Bug fest out. Uh where do I keep my 64? I uh, keep it in here. That's right, I need to dig out this pile of dirt. Ah, of 
course. How foolish of me. I did not. Wonderful. How do you get in? Right here. Uh, let's see. Actually, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven blocks. So we'll put it one, two, four, right here. Perfect. One of them found a bed. One of them found one of the beds. One of them found one of the beds. <laughs> he found his bed. He can go to sleep. Did I really start chopping down this tree and then never finish it? I feel so foolish. This is great. We've got these guys building started. Alright. One white one more white bed. Three. Three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Perfect. Now to do some other stuff. This is the design we're going for for this house because this really does not need to be very much at all. You blooming? Put that back. All right. This is good. This is going pretty good. We found a weird village. Oh, great. You know what? That's fine. As long as we're doing that, let's get more of these. Put some bushes up, too. Because why not, you know? Perfect. That's enough. Some more there. Add one, two more beds. And then I think... We will be, that will be all I need. Probably going to leave some light, get some torches here. One, two, three. Oh no. I mean, not probably, I pretty much have to put torches here. for me I think for the time being I need to put more stuff in there to properly finish off this little village that I've accidentally created or that I found that didn't have anything so I was like hey you know who could use a house and some stuff these guys door and I don't have any torches on me do I have any light sources in my tools box I don't hmm do I have any in here miscellaneous chest would be a good place to check I think 
I have a light blocks. That's fine. I'll put it right here. I think that works. Does it look good? Of course not. I didn't need it to look good. I needed it to work. What the heck? Oh. We just, uh, OBS just stopped for a sec. Or OBS says it disconnected, which indicates that it disconnected from stream. So if you're watching this on YouTube, which, good job. <laughs> you, you deserve all the praise you can imagine. All the praise that is imaginable. Uh, that means nothing to you. If you're watching this on Twitch, hey, sorry the stream went down for a moment. It wasn't it wasn't on purpose. Oh yeah, five deep slate emerald, fifty eight regular emerald ore. I know there'd be plenty of people who'd be like, Oh, why don't you just harvest that stuff? It's like cause it's I don't need it for harvesting. I need it for aesthetic purposes. That's literally the only reason to have any of this stuff. Uh, oh, okay. OBS was just telling me it reconnected. I knew that already, but thank you for telling me. Put my axe away. Put my shoes away. I think I got everything put back away. Awesome. So yeah, I think I'll build it in the middle of the ocean. And just steal villagers from other places nearby. Pick up. Put. Awesome. Oh, 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 I gotta take a picture so I know where this is. This is the strangest village I have ever made. Alright, you wanna, you want, you want the bed? Go ahead, buddy. Go ahead, buddy. We got a bed for you. Right in there. Go ahead, go get it. Nighttime. Other people are in their beds. Come on. You know you want a bed. Oh, he just warped to it. That's fine. And you, you also want to warp to your bed. Come on. Get in your beds, fellas. That's fine. Oh, fuck. I want. My goal here was to take a screen cap so I could see the coordinates. Perfect. But yeah, I want to have like a collection of every type of villager possible. So I'm also going to take a screen cap of this little jungle that was over here somewhere. Right here. Perfect. So I can have some villagers make a villager here. So we can have this sort of be like a melting pool of like all the different types of villager. And you know, I said I was going to start building that today. I guess I was wrong. Because I did not start building it. And I am probably going to end the stream soon because I'm quite tired of playing Minecraft and talking. Talking while playing Minecraft is difficult. This is why most people, most like, people who record their YouTube, record their Minecraft, would be like, alright, it's time lapse time, huh? We're going to do a time lapse here with some maybe some brief intersperses in the middle of me having said something. But then again, also, there are some people who stream 100% of their Minecraft stuff and, like, are always doing things like that. Why did it put me out up here? The one on the ground is closer. And has a, uh... freaking whatever I don't care enough anymore the upside to also to that is I will not have to cart these villagers through the nether I'll be able to cart them through the overworld as I said then there's going to be the fun part of 
making like getting villagers of all the kinds and I and by fun I mean I'm gonna hate that but it's also gonna be kind of interesting to see you know I love the idea of having villager types that like technically don't exist anymore or technically have never existed like there is no such thing as a jungle village or a swamp village but I'm going to have at least one jungle villager and at least one swamp villager Oh, I broke that portal. That's cool. I didn't know I did that. Wow. I gotta go up here to my house. I like this house. Excuse me. Oh, great. There's a fucking chef in there. Hey, chef, you mind making me some, uh, some burgers? That's what I do as a chef, is I make burgers. That's not true. I cook fries. It sucks. It's annoying as hell. Alright. You know, I should probably start, get start, like, get ready to actually start doing that build part of it. You know what? I'm gonna keep this grass and dirt block in my, this grass and dirt blocks in my inventory. Ooh, special thought that I just had is also what if I built like each type of villagers section of the ship in the style of their like oh oh by the way it's gonna be a UFO it's gonna be a giant flying saucer in case that was not obvious by the fact that I kept saying abduct that I was going to abduct villagers <laughs> oh this is this is gonna be great why did I try to use that bed? What am I thinking? My thought is, oh, bed, use it. Like, wh why is that my thought process, though? Ooh. I'll put those, you know what? I'll keep those on my inv in my inventory for now. That's what I was doing. I needed to get a bunch of string and I, then I needed to I needed to find out how much string I have over here at this mob farm, and then I needed to go to my uh, really wow I was really trying to build a uh, an item sorter here and I just stopped. Got bones. We got sugar. <laughs> I love this. This is funny to me. You got a cauldron. What for? Don't know. Does this even work? I don't have a trident in there. Sad. where I saw a spider sticking his little legs out. This was supposed to be creepers only. That's why the glass here is green. Hmm. Where else might I have a bunch of string? Because 11 string ain't going to cut it. We need a bunch of string if we are going to make a bunch of scaffolding. We got 10 in here. Total of 21 so far. That's pretty good. Now you may think, well, you got 64 and 15 leads. Why did you make all those? You know damn well I didn't. You know damn well I killed for them. I would kill for the string they use to make them right now but I don't have a spider farm <laughs> I need string this was from when you could uh, dupe potions by doing this it was a funny little glitch 
This one was supposed to be pitch black, but it wouldn't let me put in pitch black on a sign because it thought it looked too similar to bitch. Which is fucked up, and I don't know if they've fixed that yet. Alright, let's see how many I can make. We're just going to make as many as possible also. Really? A little less than a stack, huh? Well, that happens. That happens. Let's... Okay. One, two, three. Okay. That should be ten. Perfect. We're going to put more sticks in my uh, furnace over here. You know, I ought to cook a stack of stone once the uh, thing goes through, though. Just so we can have it turn on again, because I always love when that happens. Let's see if it's going yet. Problem is I have to wait for it to to go. So it'll not like crash or anything. Or not like mess with the system or anything. Cause sometimes it'll take stuff from the materials one, because the materials one goes over the uh like you can't see it probably. But the materials cart goes over the uh what's it called cart? The the fuel cart. So I don't want the fuel cart taking any of my uh stuff and dropping it in the wrong hoppers and confusing the system so it's got to make i think hold on so it's five stacks and we put a whole stack of furnaces in there so it's got to go two and a half laps to get everything out approximately ah inside my head huh sorry gotta go approximately two and a half laps in fact you know what let's go ahead get back here yeah how's about that yeah now you're real close you're up real, up close and personal huh let's take off my hat oh feels good I hate wearing hats oh, looks like it's going on its third and final trip not that you can see it. I mean, you can see that down there. I can see that on the screen. And you can see that you might be able to see that there's a ladder right there. That was how I got in and out. Whenever I was fixing and changing things. We'll actually cook two stacks of stone just for the sake of things. All right, is this guy back? He is back. This is great. I considered using kelp blocks to fuel all this, but then comes the problem of these, like, sticks you are using, you waste less fuel. Oh, yeah, by the way, there we go. It's all turning on. This is why I built this in the way that I did. So this would happen. And then these ones are about to turn back on. Oh yeah. Oh, yep. And they come out up here. The water stream leads up there. I forgot about that until the until they started popping up in my inventory. <laughs> yep. 
Yeah, that'll fall in. And I should get all the stacks I put in there, because at one point I wasn't, because because one of the hoppers was facing the wrong direction. There you go. Two stacks. Smooth stone. And I can cook up to five stacks at a time. Though it's better to cook an even amount of stacks. So that way it only has to do two trips. Okay. I need more string, man. I got it. There's got to be a good way to get string that I... Do I have a bunch of string anywhere? Like, I know I, like, always put my mob sh drops and stuff somewhere random. Like, if I could just... If I, if I had properly built that mob farm, I think I might just do that. Like, destroy that mob farm. Or leave it there for posterity, but then build another one. Like, that actually works. Also might make a completely automated bee farm at some point. I just like this room though. Got all the pink and purple flowers in it. It's pretty cool. And we got the sugarcane room. And this was going to be an aquarium, but my uh my uh my, my guys despawned. You know the guys. The little amphibians, endangered species. And also, I was going to auto-harvest this, as you might be able to tell by this block here, and this block here, and the fact that this is made of, of glazed terracotta and that's made of glazed terracotta, but uh, it just didn't work. I couldn't get it to work. It would get to about here and then go back, and I'm like, what the hell? Why? Why would you go back like that? And it's like, hmm, I don't know. going to make it so I could idle here and just let it do that like once every day or so once every in-game day just like go forward and knock everything off but it didn't work so uh so we gotta break all our canes by hand but that's okay I was able to get it in this really, really efficient manner. Like, this is the most efficient sugarcane planting or planting uh, shape. I have to make sure I got all of these. Oh, another. And so we were able to fill this whole room. This cell, let's see, it starts at 193, 465, and ends at 209, 480. So that's that's a pretty big room to be filled with sugarcane. Oh, and this button was from whenever I was going to have it be automated. And this is what I've harvested from it so far at this point. Pretty good, pretty good, honestly, I think. Yeah, also we got this. This was where I was keeping my uh, little buddy uh, Sunday. But uh, Sunday disappeared. So did Friday. So did Saturday. Nope, Saturday's still there. But uh, Many of my mobs did disappear, though. I just want to find some s spiders so I can get some strings so I can make some more freaking... Whatever the hell it's called. Can't you also get string from trading in the nether? From trading uh, gold to pig lens? Yeah, 
And I could probably uh, just wander around in this area long enough to get a uh, skeleton to spawn in that uh, box and then like name him kill E or something or to kill you kidding me I didn't get any string from that second spider it's so stupid I want to cry cry and pee and poo and go home and never talk about this again Oh, nice. What do we get? Fire resistance potion. That's cool. Oh, of course I got a fire resistance potion. I have flames. A fire aspect on my sword. Flames is the one for bows. I can never remember this sort of thing. You know, my younger brother uh, came onto my stream one time and was like, well, what do you have knockback for on your sword? And it's like, why the fuck wouldn't I have that? Like, okay, sure. You want to repair creeper holes all the time? That's your fucking deal, dude. I personally am against having to repair creeper holes. I hate it. It sucks. Are you kidding me? Ooh, zombie villagers. Oh, also since I want uh, the the trading station that I build in the sky, the the the, the UFO trading station that I build, I want that to be uh, like useful like a good trading area I definitely think I'm gonna have to what was the thing I was gonna say oh that's right I also see the creeper here and I remember I was gonna build a gunpowder farm in the nether I'm gonna farm uh different kind of guy than normally is farmed for gunpowder. <sighs> Ghasts. Gonna build a ghast farm. That's what they're called. And worse, that is correct. Oh my god, wait a minute. Regular spiders in Minecraft are brown? I thought they were just like gray, but I got close to this one was like, oh yeah, look, it's brown. What the And I know, I know, I'm colorblind, whatever, but like, they was gray the whole time and nobody done told me, or they was brown the whole time, and nobody told me that. Like they are, like they're a brown recluse. One of the most dangerous types of spider in North America. And that sounds like I'm being dramatic, but I am only sort of, because it is true but I'm saying it in a dramatic voice. You ever just say stuff that's true in a dramatic voice? Ah, an infant. Piss off. Suck my wiener. And actually don't. Because it's uh, among two reasons. Two reasons. One, it's a zombie. And that'd be messed up. Two, it's a child. That'd be messed up. Ooh, camouflage working for you, eh, Creepo? No! I hate him. I hate this man and everything he stands for. Stop shooting me into the pit.
because my knockback didn't work on that creepo for some reason. Like he's got knockback resistance or something. Which is not a thing. I don't think they can get knockback resistance. Oh, I ran out of rockets. That's what was normally in that spot. Ha ha ha. I had no idea. I mean, I had some idea. I was like, I ran out of something. But I don't know what. And I don't care enough to find out right now. We got a bunch of stuff. Pretty good. Pretty good, I think. <coughs> you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna do some enchanting. Cause I don't have a fully enchanted bow because I never I don't care. Regular bows suck, there's no purpose. I have tridents and stuff. Like this one, really good. My other one, also really good, because tridents are cool. Like, the fact that the other one has loyalty and channeling, that's that's awesome and important. Because it means if I need, uh, if I want to get a brown cow, a brown uh, mushroom, that is, I can just do that. I can go literally to a mushroom biome and strike a cow. Like, I can bring a cow bring a mushroom into the water and just toss that at it whenever there's a thunderstorm happening. And then the fire will instantly go out and then I can pull it back to land and bring it back home safe and sound. That was a lot of talking where I didn't really say anything. All right, so we also got Leather shirt, worthless. Bow, worthless. Uh, actually, we'll go ahead and keep those three, and we'll disenchant the one in the middle with this grindstone up here. And then we'll uh, repair them. Uh-oh. Bow's shaking. I thought they fixed that bug. Power four, that's pretty good. We'll go ahead and whatever that is, you know. And just power four, huh? Really gonna do me dirty like that? Screw you. No, yeah, while we're here, let's also dis disenchant that as we throw it in here, because I don't need it. Gold armor is easy to get, you know. Wow. Unbreaking three, and we get unbreaking three power four. That's I could get more. I could get more. I have, I have the levels to spare. No. Geschlecht goes back. Punch one, huh? Uh, let's see what it is anyway. Just punch one. For a level 30 enchantment, you give me just punch one. Eat my whole asshole, you stupid thing. Flame one, huh? Flame unbreaking in power. That sucks. Hello, Griffin. Hello, chat. Something. Okay, flame two, punch one, power four. Okay. We got a good uh, bow now. Also, hello to you. Yeah. I figured. I just didn't say anything, because... I didn't want to bring attention to it. Oh, cool. We got gunpowder in there, so that's the place I can put that. Oh, we got garbage in here. Also, this is good. We got... Finding where I'm put it, where I've put all this garbage. Uh, whatever, we'll just put all this crap here for now. Whatever. Cincinnati, Ohio. Ooh, that's 
He got important, something. Actually. He got something important. I don't know what, and I don't want to know what. I don't know what, and I don't care to know what. Get this. Oh, a card. I, I need that. Why? Because the other one's about to expire, and I won't be able to use it. Oh. At the end of this month, it expires. String. That's okay. I have enough. I have enough scaffolding now, so I can build the thing where I need to build the thing, and then I can abduct villagers for an achievement. What are you, some kind of alien? No aliens here. No Siri Bob. Nope. No, no UFOs being built in the desert. Sorry, over the ocean. It's not happening. Not abducting villagers. Like say then. Sure. We can do that. <sighs> what am I here for? What am I doing? Can you not? Like, I know that all the people are like, oh, we now gotta get rooted dirt, and they kept turning regular dirt into rooted dirt. Can you not mix the hanging roots and a dirt block to make rooted dirt? I think that, I, like, if, if you can't, wasted opportunity right there, I think. Uh, come on, brain. Brain and brain. What is brain? Indeed. Take this since I'm here. Uh, what the fuck am I doing? I know that I was gonna end the stream soon because I cannot. My brain is not working properly right now. Food. I have no food in my inventory. I have an empty meal slot in my inventory. We'll go with the steak because I have a lot of steak. Ooh. Oh, I was going to say, I should probably go uh, over to your uh, Enderman farm to repair my armor and stuff, but nope, it already got repaired. <sighs> hmm. You can still go there, just for funsies. I did that earlier. I did that earlier because I saw another guy do something in uh, Java Edition that I wondered if it was possible with in Bedrock Edition, and it is. You can, in fact, harvest the... Uh, chorus flowers with a bow but more importantly i wanted to see if if that was possible in bedrock at all if you could also harvest them with a trident you cannot which i think is silly you should be able to harvest them with a trident strange oh he's wearing a hat yeah oh these guys are all farmers because they have to be farmers to harvest the stuff taters and carrots and beetroot And this will be important because I want to have in my UFO. That's not a UFO. I'm not building a UFO over the over the desert, the ocean. I'm not building it over the desert. I'm building it over the ocean. Uh, I want to have a villager of every type. Oh, also, I want to start making fast horses again because I don't know if that glitch still works. I hope it does because that's a pretty fun glitch. And currently, I don't have all my horses disappeared, but okay. Good night. Perfect. Oh. Come on, come on. Fucking hell. There we go. That's how we get them out. Oh, and this is how we capture the baby horse. Good idea, brain. <laughs> how fast is this dude? Not very, huh? 
Oh, I don't have the saddle on me, huh? Yeah, so we're going to do this before I end the stream today instead of actually starting the thing. But uh, I've revealed what it was. So if I stream Minecraft again, you're like, what the hell is that giant thing you've built? It's like, uh, just watch my previous stream and you'll see what the giant thing I built was. Stupid. Come on. Sheesh. Can you really believe these guys not watching every single stream that I, a random person, do? Gosh. Where the hell, then, would be my saddles? Have I been getting rid of them? Because I know I have. I should have a shitload of saddles. And they're not here, which is a bad sign for me. And I should have a shitload of saddles because I've fought a shitload of raids. I fought sh Raid Shadow Legends. Every time they try to, they come to me, they're like, hey, we'll give you some money for doing this. And I'm like, I don't want your blood money, Raid Shadow Legends. Oop, it's raining. And it's nighttime too, so I ain't. I'm flying uh, over to my other area. This is a joke. Raid Shadow Legends has never done this. If they did, I would still say that I don't want their blood money, but, I mean... I'm not I'm not going to lie to people and say, Oh, Raid Shadow Legends is a fun game, because it's bullshit. It's a bullshit game. Ah, ha, ha. I knew I had saddles over here. You know what? I should probably get another saddle also. Because I need one saddle for parent A, and another saddle for parent B, or for, for the baby. I don't care how fast this guy is, because uh, if he's got good enough stats, he's, he's going into the, the pit. Oh, I think this was one of the later generation guys anyway. So that's pretty good. I mean, we can see his stats. We can see that he's relatively fast. Oh, that's right. I need uh I need my hay bales and I need my I need hay bales and I need golden carrots. I have golden carrots in here. But I do not have the hay bales, because the hay bales are for uh, speeding up the growth of the babies, the baby horses. And I need those, so that I don't have to deal with slow-growing baby horses. And the golden carrots are for making the horses able to go, you know? I should probably build one of those small sort of like semi-auto farms for uh... Okay, so I do not have that in here it would seem. Where the hell would I have that? In here? No. You got a smoker in here, that's good. If I ever need that, which I might. Found my EC miscellanea. There it left. No, 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 no. Hmm. Looks like I don't have any. I should have some. I should have a lot, though. Come on, surely it's somewhere. It has to, it literally has to be somewhere. I don't know what the hell I would have done with it. Did I put it over here where Eddie is? This is Eddie, by the way. The pain pig. 
His goal is to take damage, and then you throw a splash potion of healing at him. Okay, we got a bunch of bread over here, probably bought from villagers. Okay. Got a bunch of guys in here. Huh. Bunch of unemployed guys. Sheesh. Get a job, you lazy idiots. things that I'm looking for in here. Looks like we don't, annoyingly. gotta have them somewhere because I had a bunch of them for when I was doing this previously is there nothing there here no nope So I'll be using a lot of this since it's over the ocean. Pretty cool content, I think. And I wonder if that bugs where you can't uh, take off your boots after you've damaged them. On the if you after you've damaged them using uh, soul speed, I wonder if that still works. So we're just gonna drift through here. Can we take them off? We can. So it looks like they have fixed that bug. That's cool. Last time I played, they still had that bug for some reason. Which is odd, but, you know, it happens. I can't say that they're, like, evil for having kept in a bug accidentally. We'll just do that for now. Hey, buddy. Creepy creeper. Get the hell out. Is what we're doing. Oh, that's right. I can just hit this one button and it hits both of them. Okay, fellas. We got a new baby. Come on. Come on out, buddy. Can pretty fast. Oh, that's right. I I can just Oh, perfect. Get the hell out of that boat. That's for my baby horse. Who I'm going to put into this pit over here. Or not. Actually, no, I can't put him into the pit. It's as easy as doing this. Wrong way. Perfect. Awesome. There we go. We've got a baby horse. In the pit. Can you feed them golden... Oh, you can feed them golden carrots to make them bigger. That's perfect. I think uh, hay bales are just generally used because hay bales are fast.
Oh, this guy's pretty fast. This is good. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna do this one more time. A few more times, actually. I'm gonna put my voice boodily gub back. Hey, get out of here, you. Oh, it's the gunpowder from the creeper I sniped. I snoped. What you selling, homie? You freako? Okay, it's nothing I need. Sand, maybe, but like... Like, man, if you really want sand, there's better ways to get it. Okay, so what we're gonna do now... I'm gonna move Spoodly Gub out. See, he's not in there anymore. New guy... You're the one you're the one to go next. That's right. I'm doing some messed up stuff here. Alright, alright. Uh what is my goal here? Oh yes. Spruce boat. Gonna put this right here so we can get the new baby into the hole. Oh, I don't even know if uh, the old one is ready to bone down yet. Oh, looks like he is. Excellent. <laughs> oh, irrelevant. Actually, it looks like he might not be. It's fine. We'll just hit them again. Yes, there we go. A new, faster infant has been born. Perfect! He got straight in the boat, like a good little horsey. I should probably get another donkey too, so I can make a really fast donkey. So that way when I make a really fast uh, mule, it'll be a simple case of So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this was the old one out, so we're gonna take him. In fact, we're gonna take him and we're gonna go take him all the way back over here. Put him out to pasture. He's done for. Oh, he's fast. Oh, yes, quite fast. It's pretty good, but I've had faster horses before. So we're going to go ahead and slap this guy right in there. And I think I'm going to have to get another horse with a different design because I really want a different horse. I don't want a gray horse. Yeah, it is. But I think I am going to make these guys have a few more babbies. Baby horsey. We want the baby horsey. How many more arrows do I have? Hard to check. Okay, we got 12 more chances, huh? Yeah. Alright. Feed, 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 feed. Awesome. Perfect.
or not. I swear if they have one right now with their slowed uh, stats, this is bad. That would be bad for me. It's fine. Hey, hey, get the fuck out of here. Fuck out of here, you bastard. Sick of this guy. Okay, so... Oh, hello, I didn't even notice that anyone said it. That, I'm sorry, I've just been sort of focused on the... Achieving. Not actually achieving right now. I'm just trying to make a really, really, really fast horse. Because in Bedrock Edition, there's currently currently still a bug where if you put uh, speed 2 on a horse before you breed it the speed 2 stat counts towards its its own speed so you you breed faster and faster horses to the point of eventually you have a horse that's so fast that it's like yeah it's not even worth doing anything it's just like Okay. Yeah. Perfect. And a little gray baby will drop out. Right? No. Hmm. That sucks. You must be confused that, like, the love hearts aren't working properly. Oh, that's part of, that might be part of the problem, huh. Come on, get closer together. Push closer together, come on. Okay, fine, they don't have the bubbles anymore. This is so annoying. It is not working. I really, really would like the fastest horse to not be this guy. I'd like it to be a different one. Come on. I'm sick of you two. <sighs> Alright. Try it again. Why are you not doing this? Come on, get closer together. Is that the problem? Of course, it's not the problem. You're just stupid jerks. We'll wait until they're not in love mode again. To just sort of... Sometimes what you have to do is you just have to readjust the horses. Because they're stupid. Okay. So you, we're going to get out. Perfect, perfect. That should be helpful. It'll hopefully be helpful. Come on. Perfect, now they're gonna fucking make a baby, aren't they? Okay. That's fine. Come on. I am so sick of this crap. Get the hell out of there. See, the problem is this guy's pretty fast, but I could, like, I could definitely make him faster. making him have a child that is faster. How many more chances do we have? Six. Not a lot of attempts. Okay, okay. Yes, yes, we got a faster baby. <laughs> and we
we've trapped the faster baby in this. So we can just drag him into my pen that I have built up over here. No. All right. Thank you, Spoodily Gub, for getting out of my Saturday. The man is a fiend. He loves the boat. He really, really wants to get in the boat. That is fine, though. We can just break the boat before he gets. In. Okay, that's fine. The baby is on that side, so he's not gonna get hurt. Because his hitbox is too small. I'm not trying to get no Saturday. Bad. Bad boy. And I would be using hay bales to grow him up, but... I am not... Skilled and I am not... Uh, I don't have enough. This. You may notice how they're all gray. Uh, it is the result of a funny little thing. I did not get on here. Freaking Saturday! I got on. Come on, you can you can do it, oh, buddy. All right, cool. Let's see how fast this dude is. Oh hell yeah, this guy. This guy is a top level speedster. Oh crap. I built this whole path system exclusively for riding horses. Let's go to Merlin's area just to show you how fast I can get there. And I would have built a path system or the path to go to Griffin's area, but Griffin said, please don't. And I said, okay. And I'm thinking I might want to go a few more generations just to see how fast I can get. Just, just, it's like that, like that meme from the from the Marvel movies, or no, no, that's right. The meme's not from the Marvel movies. It's from uh, Naruto, where Naruto's boyfriend's brother says that the reason he killed them all was to test his killed the rest of his family was to test his strength, and then also, I've seen that with uh, Rugrats characters. <laughs> that one's kind of funny. And that's that's why it's a meme. This is pretty good. It, this guy's almost as fast as Friday was. Before she uh, was erased by the game, she vanished without a trace. Not even her armor remained. I'm so mad. Holy crap! This dude just cleared. Hold on, hold on. This dude just cleared without jumping a three-block gap. Look at that shit. Look at this. So fast can clear a three block gap. Oh my god, almost can clear a four block gap. Can almost clear a four block gap. Okay. Okay. Come on, baby. Get out of the water. Do not get wet. You do not want to be wet. All right. Perfect. Oh, looks like it's getting nighttime. Let's zip back. Or zip to anywhere with a bed. But all my beds are over here. Actually, I have a bed over there. And I have my lead with me. <coughs> this lead was for when I had Friday. She was cool and I liked her a lot. She was very fast, just like this guy. 
and her and Saturday had a child, and that was Sunday. I don't even need the lead. I can just toss my new guy in here. Uh, no, you're going in the pit, not on the side of it. Thank you very much. Awesome. It's a shame you can't enchant horse armor. That'd be pretty cool to just put feather falling and, uh... Oh, what's another good enchantment to put on a horse armor? Oh, I fucking love the clearing a three block gap. That's so incredibly powerful of this horse. Okay, no, he can't quite clear a three block gap. Which is why I need to make a faster horse. I need a horse that can clear a three block gap. <laughs> I don't, actually, but I would love to have one. You know what I mean? Just the concept of a horse being so fast that just while running, they can clear a gap that's three blocks in width. They are in, in the correct order. Oh, Andy's got better health than the last ho than my last few horses. All right, you boys ready? Oh, awesome! Perfect. Instantly, we get a new baby, a new baby boy, a beautiful bouncing baby boy. Oh, ain't that lovely? We love him. Love us a good horse, baby. It's fine. I'll get Spoodily Gub in a second. Spoodily Gub, you fiend! You cannot escape. This pit is for horses. On purpose. Okay, perfect. Oh, you want to be over there? That's fine. He is a fool of a foal. And that's the last horse pun I will make today on how it's made. <laughs> Perfect. We're gonna go take this dad's saddle. We're gonna just send him over to the pit. Hey, have fun with your uh, dad and your cousin or whatever. I don't know. It's weird. It's bullcrap. It, you know how it is when you have uh, video game animals and you are trying to get the fastest video game animal possible. Horse. Yes. Horse. This guy's not as fast, honestly. He's just... Still pretty fast. He is pretty I don't think he could clear a three block gap yet. You know what, here, why don't we go check the three block gap that I had, or that I was trying to clear, to see if he can clear it yet. As I said, I don't think he can. Three block gap. Go. Okay, well, if you're heading straight at it, you can, in fact, clear a three block gap. I might be hitting an angle and why it looks like that, but I do want... This is pretty good. This guy's pretty good. I'm going to... Go a few generations more to make a horse of a different color. If you'll. Because I do not want a gray horse. They're nice and all. 
but I would like to have a, a horse that is black or white or brown. Oh, that's right. I gotta put this guy in here. Get on this guy. Where's the bucket? What? Who's in the bucket? Uh, for the time being, yes. What a crazy motherfucker. We got a lot of gray horses in here. So what we have to do is we have to go find a horse that is white or brown or black. To do that, we got to go out to these plains out here. And I was going to stop. Oh my God, it's almost six o'clock. Jesus Christ. You know how it is with the passage of time. Technically, yeah, sure. But I mean, also like, oh God. I wonder if what happened, if all that happened is they were just like, oh, what if we just put a cap on horse speed? Because it sure seems like that guy was not moving much faster than his dad. Oh, a donkey. Should probably get a second donkey. So that way I can uh, actually make a really fast donkey at some point. So that way I can have a really fast mule. instead of a pretty fast mule. Like, Saturday, when he still existed, he was pretty fast. Oh god, the screen just started getting, getting a red tint on my end for a second. I see that it was not, uh, it did not show up on the, on the main screen, but I swear that was a red tint. Donkey. Get it, like, in Shrek. I like this path being like perfectly straight because it makes it sort of like weird. It's like why is this why are all the others like sort of organically flowing and this one's perfectly straight? It's because that one goes through the area where all the torches are placed in a like perfect grid with these two giant stone boxes. And I was like that looks kind of fucked up and un and weird. I think it'd be great if we just sort of built the whole thing around it being fucked up and weird. All right. Saturday. We could have done what I did last time and just let Saturday be the dad of the the last of whatever mule I make, but I think Saturday is going to be like the great grandfather of whatever mule I make. Because I don't know if that actually works with donkeys. If it does, great. If it doesn't, it's like, ah, this is not surprising. But I know it does work with mules because you can get a really fast mule by getting a really fast donkey. Or by getting a really fast horse. And then having that horse make a mule with a with a donkey. God, I I have so many things I need to do in Minecraft. Okay, I'll kill it. And by need to do, I mean want to do. Like, the reason I'm building a UFO is for the Star Trader achievement. It's not a UFO. Of course not. Y you've identified it. You want to throw hands? I'll throw hands. I ain't afraid of you. I'm sorry, I'm in your way. But uh, yeah. actually, you know what? I'm not sorry. I'm in your way. You put the computer here. There is only Ooh. so many places brown in horse. the world. You want brown and white horse? This guy seems pretty slow. Come on, dude. I'm gonna keep this guy anyway, though. Mm. You know what? I'm also gonna tame his little friend here, and uh, we're 
both gonna and we're gonna go on a big journey. I like that one son David that showed up in Final Fantasy. Who? No wait, that was Boston. Oh, okay, I get what you're saying. It's wrong, but I get what you're saying. Are you kidding me? Broke a lead. How? How are you that slow? Come on. I hate how leads break if you're trying to fucking go at a reasonable fucking pace. Come on, slow bro. You sicken me. This is slow growing, not Minecraft. <sighs> I could walk faster than this freaking horse. That's not me being sarcastic. I could literally, in game, and probably in real life, Walk faster than this horse runs. Why did he decide to do a 360 no scope type of deal? Alright. They're not going to despawn because they're tamed, so that's fine. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to. Monsters, where the hell is it? Oh, it's down there. Fuck off. Bonehead. I can't believe I missed that chat from a viewer. First time chat. Oh, the pain is unbearable. I mean, as many follows as I've seen and just completely missed. Like, I I I, I try to be. I try to talk to the first time chats, but yeah. Like, but I mean, that's the thing is, I was sitting here playing my video game and I did not notice. That there was someone in the chat. But it's like, it's like, I don't, I try not to let it beat me up anymore. Okay, this is the way to do it. Just go, and then it's like, oh, looks like it's stretching too far. Then you stop. Come on, stupid. I would like to find a horse that is good and fast. So that way I don't have to... Actually, you know what? I could probably just... With this speed trick I've been using, I could probably just get a fast horse that looks like Slowbro over here. In fact, he's, he's getting named. He's getting named Slowbro. Oh, I could I could name him like a freaking racehorse. Name him Snail's Pace. It's like yeah. It's like oh, who's this? It's like oh, this is Snail's Pace. He's the slowest goddamn horse I've ever seen. Literally, I had a donkey that I picked up just before him. Faster. What about what about Bad Horse for a name? That's a that's a good name for a horse. But I don't like Joss Whedon. That's fair. Joss Whedon is someone you cannot like. I know fucking nothing about that guy. Oh. I know that he's, he made that movie. He's, he's the reason why, like, every goddamn character in every goddamn movie is always making sarcastic quips all the time anymore. Like, it's like, oh. Fucking hell, it's a goddamn Joss Whedon film. Of course it is. And then it's not actually a Joss Whedon film, it's just... Joss Whedon has sort of poisoned the, uh... The system here. Yeah. Alright, slow bro. 
fact, right now, before I do this, I'm actually probably going to end the stream right here after I name this guy. We're going to name him... Supposing I have any name tags in here, which if I don't have... Oh, I'd have them in here, don't I? St why did you put that on the wall, stupid game? Perfect, perfect, perfect. I need to fly somewhere else to put that away, don't, to get that stuff, don't I? God damn it. There's AC just laying there. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, I don't have an anvil here. Of course I don't have an anvil here. God damn it. This dude's gonna be named Snail's Pace. Gonna name him, and that's gonna be the end of the stream for today, because I'm tired as fuck. Oh god, my ass hurts. Fuck. From sitting on the floor. I hate it. But I want to stream because I'm having fun. God, nope, wrong button. S N A I L apostrophe S P A C E Snail Space. Shit, my cost one. Oh, I broke my anvil. Uh, let me put a block there that says anvil. Oh, perfect. Perfect block to put there that says anvil. Now I'll know what to put there. <laughs> Oof. Alright, where's my new progenitor of a new line of s hopefully very fast horses? The slowest motherfucker alive, snail's pace. And I am going to try one more time to see- one time to see if I can get him. Oh my god, he can't even jump! I thought he was brown, he's a white man! Because as we all know, due to movies, white man can't jump. We know this because of movies. Space Jam. That is a different basketball film. Are you fucking kidding me? They're not gonna do it? They're not- they're not making babies. I'm so fucking mad. I think the boat was too close. <sighs> well, it's Boodley Gov Saturday. You guys will have a new Freako in there. Hopefully a very fast one. Very fast, hopefully. Baseball. And, and, come on, come on, boys. No. Okay, they're looking at each other, but they don't have the swirls anymore, which means they're not gonna if they make a if they make one, they're not gonna make a fast one. That's fine. Good. Okay, we got we have very few more attempts. Okay, okay. They're facing each other. They're facing each other, but they don't have this stuff anymore. Sorry. You should be. Okay. This is their last chance. And if they don't do that, I'm... Done for the day. Okay. Come on. Make a fast one for me, fellas. Of course they look at each other, but they don't do anything. Horses won't make babies. Yeah, yeah. Well, this is where we're ending the stream today. Uh, hope y'all had a great time. And if you did, like, I hope. 
a dark world L or one or I. I cannot tell. Uh, I'm sorry I missed your message. It was just hi, though, so I don't know what to do about that. Uh... These freakos made so many fast babies. Holy crap, you can just put a lead on a boat. I have never... Like, I knew you could do this, but I had never actually been able to do it before. Which means you can tie a boat to a... Oh, that's so awesome. Means you can tie a boat to a thing. And I was never able to get that to work, but uh, yeah. In any case, uh, we are, I'm, I'm ending the stream. So uh, we'll go up here. See y'all next time. Uh, got all my links on the screen. Uh, nothing else to do today, or nothing else to talk about, at least. So. See you around, folks. Oh, hold on. I got a little Lotad there. You guys see him there? If As as I get more followers, Lotad gets a little bigger. He comes a little further out of the wormhole. And that's important because Lotad's cool. Okay, now we can stop. Bye.